I see that you're um, selling vinegar now. You're making and selling vinegar now? Yes. And it, do you, does your vinegar get stored in these barrels? And, yeah. and where is the facility? That's actually down at Montebello. Okay. Um, I wouldn't mind uh, trying my hand at vinegar. I actually make it at home and I don't like it. So um, do I, yeah. But it, it is something um, that you want to, you know, you, you don't really want to be making vinegar and wine right. in the same. Right. No, right. Place. I know that, yeah. And, and they have, they're, they're, they fortunately have a, a whole separate uh, facility or garage, kind of garage. Thing. yeah, mm -hmm. where they can do that. So mm -hmm. um, I would, I, pro I probably wouldn't try it myself until I had a, you know, this place sure. over there to sure. put the vinegar. Is it in stainless or is it in wood? No, it's, a, it's all in wood. Well, it's all in wood. Yeah. No, and, and I mean, some of the, I mean, I, I you know, I, when I first came to Ridge, I worked down there, in, you know, uh, 96, 97, and uh, it was called the Vinegar Bar. We'd go down there every once in a while to pull some out, and, and I mean. There was some stuff on there. I mean, I can't even remember. I mean, there was, you know, they, they, you know, they, they had kind of a Solera thing, you know, de facto Solera uh -huh. thing going on. With uh -huh. And there was 78 Cabernet, uh -huh. you know, that had 82 on top of it and uh -huh. this. And there was a lot of really old neat stuff. That's do they ever do tours there? Not that I'm aware of, but when you go down, ask Paul, say, Paul, where's the vinegar bar <laughs> these days? <laughs> I would love to see that. You might scold that. me for asking around. <laughs> Kim, Kim makes really good wine vinegar. Do you? I have, yeah, I I have several too. crocks in my kitchen yeah. growing. I've been making vinegar for about 20 years. Uh, you know, I, I, I don't... Um, you know, when you when you look out there and you see what's out there, basically I, what I find is there's industrial, you know, vinegar like you, you made your Easter eggs or whatever, and, you know, which is right. just not much going on, right? Mm -hmm. And then there's this this quasi balsamic that's got molasses and sugar and all sorts of horrible stuff in it that pours out like motor Caramel, oil. Caramel, right. Yeah. And then if you just use good wine and age it for an appropriate amount of time, and I find pretty much leave it alone. Mm -hmm. Don't do anything crazy with it. Take it out every eight to 10 months you know, bottle it up. I might throw in a sprig of thyme or garlic or whatever's hanging around. Mm -hmm. You can't beat it. You know, I mean, yeah. oil and vinegar is, is that's all I use in salad. And, you know, people come over and they're like, oh my God, you, where did you get this? <laughs> so, well, that's a secret. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, no, I agree. It's, it's fun, too. Yeah. You know? yeah.